The calendulas are lovely at this time of the year, um, in bloom into the end of winter. And um, it's, a, it's a very uh, useful herb. A um, number of different uses. You can have it as a tea. As a tea, it would boost the immune system. But something nice to do with it is to make a tincture. Now, what a tincture does is, is basically soaking it in alcohol. We're going to tell you how to make that now. But um, a tincture is concentrated, it lasts a long time, it doesn't take up much space. And you could use a tincture, a few drops of tincture in water to gargle for a sore throat. You could put it in your, in your shampoo for itchy scalp. Um, if you need to heal, heal um, the skin, it's very good topically to heal the skin. Internally also, it's good for the stomach, uh, for cramps and constipation. And um, also, it's, it's, it's an immune booster. So it's overall a really good herb and very easy to make a tincture. So what you do to make a tincture is you need, um, you need a jar and you need some alcohol. Um, you can just use something like, like vodka, which is what I'm going to use. So what you do is you cut off some flowers. Now use good flowers, don't use old flowers because the old ones have already lost their energy. Now also by picking the flowers, you're stimulating the, uh, more flowers to come. So it's actually a very good thing. So we're going to just pick a whole lot of flowers and put them in a little jar and then we're going to cover them with alcohol and um, I'll tell you what to do after that right there we go that'll that'll do for now you can put a little bit more in a half a jar um, I've got some vodka here um, I'm tempted to drink it but I won't <laughs> it's a bit early in the day <laughs> so we're going to cover it completely cover the flowers with the alcohol seal the bottle put it in a dark warm place in the cupboard inside and shake it once every day for 14 days at the end of the 14 days let it sit for a day and then strain it through a bit of cloth and there you've got your tincture now you'd use say about 20 drops uh, three times a day maybe either under the tongue or mixed with water um, that's it um, we're also going to date, date the jar so we, know we don't know exactly when it was made. Today is uh, the 31st of August. So 14 days time, 14 September, we're going to have our tincture. <laughs>